Hey, how's it going guys? Welcome back to my channel again. So, I'm your host Fahim Boshi and I'm a vocal coach, voice teacher and a singer. And today guys, I'm going to be reacting and analyzing to another heavily requested video by you guys. It's called Chen, Sorry Not Sorry, okay? So apparently, one of my, actually a few of my subscribers told me that um, I've reacted to like two of his songs from his album. And there are four other songs that's, that I still haven't reacted to yet. So that's what I'm gonna do today. That's kind of like my plan for today, that I'm gonna react to all the four videos that I didn't react to from the album, so that I complete the you know, entire album, per se. So yeah, um, once again, guys, thank you again for all your requests, your positivity, your feedback, and all your support. Now, with that all being said, let's go ahead and react and analyze this video together. Before we get started though, if you're new here, I would really, really appreciate it if you go ahead and subscribe to my channel, hit that notification bell because I will be uploading videos very, very often for you guys. If you like this video, be sure to give it a thumbs up and share it with your friends. I would love that. I, as you guys know, I'm a voice teacher. I give voice lessons around the world via Skype. So if you guys are interested for voice lessons or if you guys want to critique your singing, then you can go ahead and check me out at Fiverr.com, which I will leave a link on the description. Um, I also have a Facebook page and an Instagram account where I try to share my videos on my personal singing as well as you know me coaching other people out there helping them with their singing and whatnot so with that all being said let's go ahead and jump right into this video Very emotional song, okay? So this song is about a breakup, right? So we are gonna see a lot of strong lyrics. And the song is called Sorry Not Sorry. So he doesn't regret the fact that he broke up with her. Kind of like that, but we'll see. Um, so essentially the song is based in the key of B flat major. Right, so as the song progresses, I have a feeling that he's gonna explode in terms of you know vocal intensity and whatnot, and it's gonna build up some B flat force, some A force, G force, definitely. Okay, so let's carry on and see what happens. Really good song. It's a very emotional song. I love his phrasing. Wow, really good. Very strong. I told you. I told you guys. The way he's doing the phrasing and whatnot, it's coming from here. Like he's not thinking about, oh, am I doing this? Oh, am I being too breathy or airy and whatnot? He's not thinking any of those things at all. Okay. Uh, he's singing from here. It's very emotional. Okay. And you can hear that it's also making you emotional. But let's carry on. <laughs> good wow wow okay okay wow so we are at the first chorus of the song right the verse was extremely vulnerable and as the chorus came on he went a little bit higher in terms of the pitch and he's still maintaining that kind of breathy texture right so essentially it's a kind of light mix voice coordination right really good really good Oh, wow, very strong lyrics. I told you guys, the happy times we spent together, I hope we never met again. Wow, or I hope we never meet again. Really strong, really strong. Okay, let's carry on. Beautiful clip on the post out of there. Oh wow. Let's not let's not to see each other even if by chance let's break up. Oh wow. I told you guys it's very strong. Wow. I love 
this part of the phrase like she are like that is so vulnerable wow it sounds so good and whatnot wow and the lyrics man the lyrics is extremely strong i'm not even kidding the lyrics is very strong Yeah, it's very emotional. Wow. It's very strong. I mean, breakups are never easy, you know what I'm saying? Let's uh let's carry on. Let's carry on. Nice. Oof, oof, oof. That part that he just sang, that's probably my favorite part. Like going from that kind of light breathy mix was to like a beautiful fall set on the top really good really good i like it let's carry on nice like that kind of little trills and run that is doing um it's making like the entire song sound so much better because like it's the perfect time to kind of do this type of so little bit of trills and run not too much crazy right because now as the song is progressing it's gonna get more intense it's probably gonna build on some high notes uh in, in a couple of seconds but uh let's see what happens let's see wow i told you i'd rather you just cursed at me oh strong strong that b flat four uh was on a chesty dominant mix voice okay um i would say it's like 60 percent chest was 40 percent it was okay i have seen him sing heavier but if, if he was about to sing this too much heavy it would have sounded inappropriate for the contact context of the song so really good really good 60 percent head uh 60 percent chest 40 percent head okay <laughs> It's gonna it, it's it's gonna make me cry <laughs> I'm trying not to cry but it's very strong like the lyrics in it itself it's just making me <laughs> emotional and then the way he's delivering the lyrics the way he's singing the lyrics you can't help but cry you know what I'm saying really good really strong really good song excellent wow I'm gonna probably listen to this a couple of times after I've done reacting to this it's really good <laughs> the lyrics I did all I can do and I gave you my heart but I have no more regrets right so Chen you know whoever he wrote the song for um, you know he wanted to make this work but she kept on you know cheating on him and whatnot and now he's over it so that's why the song is called sorry not sorry right but I have no more regrets it's it's very strong like if you think about it for a second it's a very strong song it's gonna make anybody cry if they understand the true meaning of this song We're pretty much at the end of the song okay so like my analysis this time it's gonna be more 
in the context of the lyrics, right? Um, I want to say a few more things, um, but let's uh, let's go ahead and first end this video. Okay, 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 that's just the intro, okay. Um, so first of all, like, writing these types of songs and then singing in front of a bunch of people, it's never easy, okay? And, like, I have heard emotional songs from Chen as from as EXO, you know, EXO CBX per se, um, but the, for some reason, this song really touched me, okay? Like the way he delivered the lyrics, it really touched me. And the lyrics is extremely strong. It's very real. These things happen in real life. And yeah, it's very strong. Like I, if, if like if I try to discuss it, it's probably gonna bring me to tears. So I'm not gonna get into that. So like just you know, from a vocal coach, I'm just gonna go ahead and touch on the vocal technique part since there is no official music video, so I can't talk about that. Um, so vocal technique wise is singing in a very breathy chest voice and whatnot in the verses and as the chorus came in he went into a light mixed voice and whatnot and then at the end of the second chorus the bridge section like he went to a when hit a b flat chord in a kind of chesty dominant mixed voice which was really good and when he did hit that b flat four he was like saying something very strong that's why he said that like I read the lyrics of that part I was like wow like it's, it, it couldn't be any more perfect to the time to kind of like belt out a note with emotion and he did that really good okay really good this is a very good song like anybody out there who's a songwriter as well as singer y'all should take notes from this song it's a very good song it's a very very good song excellent song I really enjoyed it Wow, I'm totally blown away. Like Chen wrote a beautiful song, and as I said earlier, I'm probably gonna go and listen to the song a couple of times before I react to another video. But yeah, and yeah, I still have to react to the other three videos. I'm gonna do that today. But yeah, um, at this point, I really don't have anything else to add here, so I'm just gonna go ahead and wrap this video here. So there you go guys, that's my reaction and my analysis of this video. I hope you guys enjoyed my reaction and my analysis because if you did, then don't forget to give this video a big old thumbs up, share this video with your friends and family, and if you haven't already, please go ahead and subscribe to my channel and hit that notification bell because I will be uploading contents like this every single day, so make sure y'all are staying tuned for all that. Let me know down in the comments what you guys thought of my reaction and my analysis, and if you guys want me to keep on doing more EXO reactions or Chen's reaction or anybody else for that matter, then let me know down in the comments and I will try to get them back to you as soon as I can. So yeah, that's it for this video. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you guys on the next one. Peace.